Rafale is one of the world's most successful fighter jet. It was first introduced in 2001. However, by the later years, this aircraft had received significant modifications. The Rafale is equipped with a variety of weaponry and is designed to execute missions such as air superiority, interdiction, aerial surveillance, ground support, in-depth strike, anti-ship strike, and nuclear deterrence. Dassault describes the Rafale as a on-the-roll aircraft. The Rafale fighter jet's marine variant has a stronger undercarriage and nose wheel, as well as a larger arrestor hook, an integrated ladder, and other minor differences from the ground version. It has the F-4 comparable standard naval variant. India is now in the process of procuring new fighter jets for its naval aircraft carrier. The F-A-18 Super Hornet, which was developed in the United States, and the Rafale Marine, which was built in France, are both strong contenders for the bid. Due to design specifications such as a stronger undercarriage and nose wheel, as well as a larger arrestor hook, modifying the configuration of the Rafale for a two-seat form is difficult. Typically, the Rafale is utilized extensively in single-seater variants. Dassault may consider developing a version in the future. As of now, it is just supplying a single-seater for the naval version. The two-seat aircraft is primarily utilized for training as well as long-range missile deployment. Ground-based aircraft can be utilized to train the Rafale aircraft if the point of view is for training purposes. If the Rafale had a two-seat variant, it would have won the competition. Since the Rafale aircraft made by Dassault is already in the Indian Air Force. Rafale has demonstrated its remarkable capabilities aboard an Indian-built aircraft carrier. According to sources, the Rafale Marine variant can fit into the India's new aircraft carrier lift bay, whereas the F-18 cannot, even with folded wings, fit into the lift bay of the aircraft carrier. The aircraft carrier can accommodate more Rafale aircraft than the F-A-18. Rafale can transport up to four or five tons of external cargo, as well as full internal fuel for the ski jump. It can carry more weaponry with less internal fuel, depending on mission requirements. With full internal fuel, it can perform all duties, including combat air patrol, intercepts, AD escort, and sea and land strike. If the Rafale Marine is selected, India may seek to lease four or five of the planes for immediate deployment. Currently, the aircraft carrier is armed with two squadrons of aged MiG-29 fighter jets. The Rafale Marine that was sent for testing is the most recent version of the fighter-specific upgrade. This fighter plane is equipped with one-of-a-kind armaments, making it a more lethal battle fighter. It's a nuclear-capable meteor air-to-air -air missile, as well as scalp air-to-ground missiles and hammer precision-guided ammunition. Please share your thoughts on the Rafale aircraft for the Indian Navy in the comments section below.